morning everyone, hope you're all doing well. Today is a Friday for me, which means it's Saturday for you, so I hope you've had a good start to the weekend. Let me know what you've got up to, or if you've got anything specific planned for Sunday, or what you're planning on doing. Maybe you're gonna have a nice chill day, because I mean, that's what Sundays are for, really, isn't it? I can't open this day, because I've got this in my hand. Hang on, wait, let me put that down. But yeah, let me know down below in the comments what you're gonna get up to, what you've got planned, what you've already done, I'd love to know. I'm just heading down to let these little puppies out. Are you guys ready to come out? Yeah. They're like, yes, please let us out. Oh God, now I'm trying to close this stair gate. Definitely close that. If not, they will be upstairs. Right, let's put this down on the table and let's let you guys out. Come on. Hello, Bob. Hello, Bales. Come on then, guys. Let's go out. This morning, as it is Friday and nearly the weekend, I thought for breakfast day I would actually make myself some pancakes. But of course, as I'm having to do this like fold my black thing, I can't just make like normal standard pancakes with flour and everything because I can't have normal flour. So instead, I'm trying to get a pan out. I am gonna make some banana pancakes. If you've never made these before, I would highly recommend. They're really simple and quick to make. And all you need in terms of ingredients, I'm sure you see, I'll use the little pan, is two eggs and a banana. That is it. And then I'm also gonna add some blueberries and some strawberries to some of them as well. And that will taste hopefully quite good. Then here I've just mashed up the banana with a fork and then I've now just whisked in two eggs and that is literally your mixture ready to go. I know some people also like to add oats to the mixture too. I've never tried that. It might work nicely as well. I don't know. I've never tried it. I quite like it like this so I'm just going to leave it as it is. But feel free to add oats too. And yeah, that is that like ready to go. What else was I about to say? I was going to say something but I can't think what it was. I don't know. But anyway, yeah, I'm gonna get cooking my pancakes now. Oh yeah, I was just gonna say about how like weird it is, like the properties of bananas, the fact that they actually don't make pancakes. Also like when I found out that if you freeze banana and then blend it up, it makes ice cream, I was like, what? But it actually like works so well. It's just so weird like what bananas can do. So to this one, I've just added some little pieces of strawberry. I think it's actually more or less ready to turn now. So I'm gonna try and turn it without the strawberry falling out. And then to this one, I've added blueberries, although it's gonna be harder to turn because the blueberries are like a lot easier to fall out when you're trying to flip it. <laughs> oh, look at this baby little last pancake. I wanted to use up the rest of the mixture. I thought I might as well because there's only like the tiniest bit left, but it would have made the previous one like massive. So I decided just to leave a little bit, but but rather than wasting it, I might as well still cook it up. So I've got a tiny little one as the last one. And here is my finished stack of pancakes. I'm literally so hungry now, so I can't wait to eat these. And also that mixture makes so many. I think I have four bigger ones than the one little one that was left at the end. But honestly, I'm so ready to eat these. Also, just a tip. Like, I never used to think of this. While you're cooking the other ones, just put tin foil all over it and it keeps them warm. I mean, that might be so obvious to you, but until someone pointed that out to me, I never used to do it. So then... Always by the time I'd finished like making pancakes or whatever, the first one would have gone like stone cold, but this bit keeps them nice and warm. So yeah, little tip for you if you've never thought about doing that. So I've just made a start on editing yesterday's vlog. I haven't really got that far with it, but the puppies are starting to look a bit sleepy now. So I'm gonna try and go upstairs quickly and get ready for the gym as I'm planning on going there this morning. I'm nice and full for my pancakes now as well. They definitely tasted good. I would highly recommend those pancakes. I've tried putting them in coconut oil before, but I'm not like the biggest coconut fan, so like for me that made them taste a bit odd. So I was like, oh, I don't know whether it's just these pancakes or not. But um, I cooked them just in normal butter today and they tasted so much better. So it depends. Like if you like coconut flavour, then cook them in coconut oil. Or if not, butter works just as well and makes them taste really good. So yeah, that's my little recommendation on those pancakes. But I'm gonna get myself ready for the gym now as it's already five to 11. And yeah, I would like to get there some point this morning. It's such a nice day out again today. I've just made it back to the car from the gym as you can probably tell from my face. And yeah, it's such a lovely day. I managed to park like pretty much around the corner from the gym today. So that is very, 
good. I didn't have a long walk. Let's see. And oh, someone was just waiting to get in this space. So I'll talk to you. Yeah, sorry, I had to cut the camera off before because as I was sat in the car, because like where I parked, as like you probably know, normally I can't get parked that close to the gym. So those spaces are always in like high demand. And yeah, some guy saw me sat in the car and was like, Are you leaving? I was like, Yeah kind of in a second but yeah so he had to stop and then there was like massive queue of cars like piling up behind him so then I was like yeah okay I need to get going so yeah but I made it back home now also yeah what was good is when I was parking there there was someone the guy leaving when I arrived um had like half an hour left on his parking ticket so he was like are you gonna park there and I was like yeah and he was like Oh, here you go, you can have the rest of my ticket. I was like, thanks. So I looked at the time, it only had half an hour, and I was like, okay, I kind of need longer than that for the gym. But it was good, I almost didn't have to pay for parking. Or like, if I was doing something where I was just going to some of the shops or something along the main high street, then I could have like popped back in between and not paid for like half of my parking. But sadly, that wasn't the case because with the gym, like, you don't really want to go there, then walk back to the car, then go back again, if that makes sense. So, yeah. But anyway, that was almost almost free parking that I got there but anyway I think I'm gonna get myself some lunch now I'm just finding a vlog to watch with lunch because I'm feeling very very hungry now so oh also I just thought I saw Zoe tweet this morning about the John Lewis advert I hadn't realized it had come out yet so I want to watch that I'm gonna make sure to watch that in a second because yeah I love John Lewis advert you know it's Christmas time coming oh it's gone a bit dark that always puts me in the Christmas mood. Like all the Christmas adverts are coming up on YouTube now as well. I love it. For lunch, I've just got myself some of the sweet potato soup I made the other day and then a couple of pieces of gluten free bread. Okay. What you got, Bubs? What you got? No, Last night, he just discovered his tail. He never used to chase it around in a circle. Bailey has done that often, but Bob's just discovered it last night and now he keeps chasing it around. And then when he gets it, he keeps pulling on it, wondering why it's not coming. Guys, there's this fly down here on the floor, which was like buzzing around the living room earlier. I thought it was dead, but every so often it like buzzes a little. I don't know if you can see now, it keeps moving its wing. I don't know whether to try and flip it over and it'll be okay, and whether it's just stuck on its back or whether it is just suffering. But then I don't know what to flip it over with. Maybe I'll just get like a piece of kitchen roll or paper or something. I don't really know what to do with it. I've managed to flip it over. But it doesn't seem to have made any difference. It's still just stuck down here, so I just don't know what to do. I might just leave it for a bit and see if it like recovers now, and if not, then just maybe put it outside or something. I don't really know. Yesterday's vlog is all edited and scheduled and ready to go up tonight. And then I've also now had a shower, finally got out my gym stuff, got myself all dressed, finally ready for the day at quarter to four. But that's all right. It's nearly the weekend, we can start to get more lazy now. I mean, to be fair, I was dressed, but I was just in my gym stuff. I had to wait for the dogs to like calm down before I could come up to get a shower. Sorry, I was just looking to see if I needed anything else. Um, so I'm gonna go downstairs now. I am also planning on editing Sunday's main channel video, which I filmed yesterday. But I think I'm gonna have like a bit of an editing break first both the dogs have been barking at something over the field out the back for like a good five minutes now like i could hear them when i was getting out the shower trying to get dressed well they've just jumped down they love um they couldn't get up there for a while and they like it's so crazy to think that they didn't actually used to reach this wall but they love going up this wall out the back here hello bales or going up me too hey look good jess hey you have a you hey bubs but yeah, this wall out the back here, they love jumping up it and looking out over the field. There obviously must have been something out there now, which they were wanting to bark at. Was this something you didn't like over there, guys? Hey, Bales. I've got through editing, like, the main body of my video, the main channel video. And, yeah, I actually managed to get that done pretty, like, quickly. It took me about an hour. Normally it takes me a lot longer, especially, like, vlogs I can edit quite quickly, but main channel videos always take me so much longer just because there's, like, all the little details, making sure it's all cut in the right places, then I always watch it back, like, 
checking it all, making sure it's all sorted, but also then for adding in links and things, so like products down below, I've got to note down all the different products that I used or items mentioned or all that kind of stuff, and then adding in like social handles, the end screen, so like overall there's a lot more to do and does take a lot longer. But yeah, I managed to edit the main body of that in about an hour, and I've now just come upstairs to record the voiceover for this video because yeah as I was explaining yesterday it's like showing something with the voiceover yeah I'm doing it in like a voiceover style video don't really know how to explain that you'll see it on Sunday anyway which is tomorrow for you so be sure to be on my main channel tomorrow at 4 p.m and a bit of self promo there but um yeah what was I gonna say that was so weird I feel like the background on my computer was like moving so like it's zooming in on it but it's not I don't know, it's some weird kind of illusion going on right now. Anyway, my um, email's popping up on screen there. Um, what was I going to say? Yes, yeah, so I'm going to oh, edit the voice over for that now. Um, but yeah, I've only got to edit, I've got to, uh, yeah, I've got to record the voice over for this. Then, um, record the voice over, then I, I edit it in, then add the background music then watch the video back and then that will be that one done. So weird because like filming, I filmed like half an hour, 40 minutes of footage yesterday when I was actually filming and it turns out it's like a six minute video. It's crazy how much you can like cut it down and like what editing does. <laughs> Something's starting to get so dark outside while I've been sat here. I've just like finished editing the video and it's just saving now so I'm going to edit the thumbnail for it now. But I literally looked up and I was like oh my god I need a light on. It suddenly got so dark in here I hadn't even realised. So I've finally finished editing and uploading and everything that video that I was working on. So that's all ready for Sunday which is good. It's now already five past seven. It's literally gone pitch black outside. Also my parents are back from work now as well so I'm gonna see if maybe you can watch another episode of Riverdale if my mum's about. Mum? Yeah. Do you wanna watch Riverdale? Oh okay. okay. Well we might watch an episode of Riverdale then. Yeah. We might as well start one. God, it's dark ground here. I'm also starting to get a little bit hungry. I know. Dad's gone off to try and find some ingredients. As it's a Friday, we're of course gonna have a curry, but we're not gonna go out on today as I'm having to do like this whole fun about that thing and we can't control what they cook with and know what they put in it exactly and stuff. So it's just easier to have one at home instead, which is also quite nice because it's pretty cold out anyway, so it's quite nice to stay at home and just get cozy anyway. But it's smelling pretty good in here. Hmm. Just have a little look. What's it looking like? Ooh, looks good. No, no. <laughs> it's a little bit hot. Yeah, no, it's all right. I only touched it for a second. But yeah, it looks good. It smells nice as well. Getting pretty hungry now as well. So can't wait to eat that. Also watched another episode of Riverdale, but now means I'm up to date with where they currently are. So got to wait like another week well, till next Thursday. So just less than a week till the next episode comes out. But... And it is all ready. I've just come up to get ready for bed. I've been sat watching a bit of YouTube for a bit on the sofa, but I'm starting to fall asleep now and I've got work tomorrow. So, yeah, I need energy for that. I'm just literally so tired. It's only, oh, I was going to say it's like just gone half ten. It's not even half ten yet. It's 25 past ten, but I'm just so tired. Wild Friday night, I know, right? But also just coming to my room and realised I've got fresh sheets on my bed. My mum's changed my bedding for me. Fresh sheets night is always the best night. Although in winter, like, the fresh sheets are colder. So I don't know if that is nice. But always just fresh sheets. It's just nice in general. And I'm kind of dreading changing right now because it's just starting to feel, like, really cold to the point where getting dressed becomes a real, like, task to try and do because... Yeah, it's just too cold to like have to change clothes. But I will get there. I'm gonna get to bed now. Hope you enjoyed today's vlog. Be sure to smash the thumbs up if you did. Click the little red subscribe button down below if you're new, and I'll see you very soon with another vlog. Night!